All right, this is it. This is it, Luigi. Day 30. The end of July. No less. Okay, welcome to the end. Which is very sinister. <laughs> Head down to the final trial and prep your army and take out 80 or so reds and 20 yellows and head to the arena you worked so hard to get to. While you're walking there, reflect about what you've accomplished throughout all of this, whether it be from a challenge standpoint or a progress standpoint. Take a deep breath and head into the arena. Before you summon the debatable meanest thing in the game, head to the other side of the arena and split your team into squad. In into two. Into two, probably. The number. Bomb squad and assault squad. Yellows with bomb rocks and reds. <laughs> Once you are ready, send Almar in by himself to summon the Emperor Bulblax. It's giant and wants to murder all your Pikmin. Thankfully, it's super slow as it'll give us some time to figure out how to adapt to it. Go ahead and grab one yellow and try to throw it right in front of its face, a little bit in front of him. Your Pikmin should wait to toss its bomb rock when it opens its mouth, then the big giant, or with its mouth with a big giant tongue. Once the bomb explodes, it'll stun him, and that's when you want to send your army in by throwing as many as you can on its face. Make sure to call your Pikmin away from him when he starts to come to. Rinse and repeat this a few more times and you'll come out victorious. Be careful though, he has a meaner phase where he'll jump up into the sky and target you and crash into your Pikmin in- Crash into you or Pikmin in its way. Once you've killed it, you'll be given your last part, the secret safe. Remember kids, money is much more important than life. He's right. This part is the only- whoops. Is the only part in the game where you can use 95- <laughs> Where you can use 95 Pikmin to carry it, which classifies it as the most. The most. You only need 40 minimum, though. With the Bulblax defeated, send the part back to the dolphin and enjoy what you've accomplished over these past 30 days by watching the ending. To those who have found this walkthrough fun and useful, thank you for sticking around through this. I've had a lot of fun making this. I hope you did, too. Alright. That's, that's nice. Daily challenges. Don't use any bomb rocks on the Emperor Bulblax. Okay, so no need to worry about yellows. And fight him with 20 Pikmin, okay? Only. Bomb rocks, okay. This guy. But first things first, uh, I want to... Oh. I kind of already knew how to fight the Emperor Bulblax, but uh, I don't remember how to do the final trial, so hold on, let me... Let me uh, go back through this again. 20 reds, 10 yellows, the rest blues. Wait, hold on, what the... Oh, I closed it, hold on. Let me pull it back up on Carl's. Fight him with 20 Pikmin. So we can do the rest with more than 20 Pikmin. Hooray! 20 reds, 10 yellows. That's Carl's recommendation. Okay. Middle to get the blue bridge. Then the yellows. Okay. Build the next, then blues again. Take the reds. Okay. So this isn't going to work out, and we're probably going to be here for a while. That's my guess. A long while. But... Let's try it anyway. Ugh! Alright. <laughs> I forgot about this song, dude. Minkus music. And then it like goes into not Minkus music, so I don't know what that's about. What, the, what did the guide say? I didn't delete it, did I? Control F. I already forget, dude. 20 reds, 10 yellows. Okay. This is evil music. So the plan is to fight it with only 20 Pikmin and, uh, no bomb rocks. After doing the final trial. We'll see how that goes. Uh, <laughs> probably not well. You call this a split? Honestly, guys, what the hell? Pikmin, dude. Fucking Pikmin, dude. Alright. Okay, there's the aforementioned bomb rock wall. 
hate ledges in this game, but you already do that after that one time. You know, honestly, it'd probably be easier to just... Holy crap, well, this isn't going to take long at all. Come on. Okay, Wii Remote, I need you to cooperate, please. Please. This is like a speed run of the highest order here. I think the idea is you're supposed to stand on this rock and it's supposed to look really cool, but I have Wii controls. Hooray! Oh, great. I'm supposed to have the, the Pikmin, uh... Is the idea to throw them in here? Uh... All right. Some of them got it. I'm gonna hope that's not the six bomb rock wall, you know? We got some more woes going. We're in the woe zone. Is this one dead? What the? Oh, there's, oh that's just a bomb rock. Okay. I thought there was a Pikmin carrying the bomb rock there. I mean, it makes me wonder if I can just, like, throw the Pikmin over here. Oh, guys. Oh, guys. 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 Honestly, guys. Guys. I did- I- look! I- I threw them as far away as I felt was reasonable. Oh, son of a bitch, you fucking morons! You idiots! Now I don't think we can do this! I hate Pikmin! I hate these things! Whistle them. Any more in there? Any more? Anything? Anything? I hate- I hate Pikmin! I hate them. You know what? We can still probably do this. Okay, hold on, hold on. No, they're gonna need to carry the gun. No, 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 the blues can do it. The blues can carry the stupid safe. Okay, okay, we home. We can still do this. We can still do this. Idiots! Obviously, no, Almar couldn't throw them above the thing, but really, in the end, you only need one bomb. The problem is getting the secret safe back in time. Uh, that's gonna be interesting. Dude, that's not gonna work. Why does it make a metal sound? Alright. While they're working on that, get the reds, throw them up there, and then... Something like that? Alright. Don't do anything stupid, okay? Nothing stupid, okay? Uh... Are you guys coming? I have to throw them up there? Okay. I don't like you. I don't like you. We've already established this. I don't like you. Okay. That's a ledge. I don't like you. I don't like you. I don't like you. We've already established this, but I don't like you. 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 Okay. Woo! Is the idea... What's the idea here? I'm supposed to... I'm supposed to get Olimar up there, right? Oh, son of a bitch. I'm probably supposed to get across the bridge and then whistle the reds over from there, aren't I? So I can't do this. Now, hold on. Never say never. Uh... Oh, wait. No, no. Hold on. Oh, fuck! I thought that this was a ledge I could walk on. Well, now, hold on. Um, no one ever said that this was impo- Ah, oh, shit. Ow. Oh. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Now, it, you know... A sane person would reset the day, but not me. Not me. I'm gonna try to make this work. The yellows fucking suck. <laughs> I don't know, dude. Uh, I don't know, dude. Stop. We remote. Stop. 
Well, no, I was gonna say, no, no, because you get it across from there. Yeah, 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 that's, that's how you do it. Honestly, you deserve it. You deserve it, you fucking assholes. Like, you saw me do it. You saw me doing the... You, like, don't even hear that, but whatever. I think that bomb rocks that don't respawn is just a really bad mechanic. <laughs> just an extremely bad mechanic. Okay, fine. Fine! Well, on the bright side, I fail both of the challenges, so... I can fight the boss normally. But I do want- no, because I only have so long in the day because of the last challenge. Which was actually a challenge for today. So today has three challenges, when you think about it. It's Galaxy Brain. <laughs> yeah, whatever, game. Oh yeah, speaking of making noises, I feel like uh, people thought that me breathing heavily during that uh, awful ledge part in the Distant Spring was serious, but that was like a joke, but I can understand why you thought it was serious because uh, of the rest of the playthrough. So, <laughs> I want to clear that up at least. But yeah, like in hindsight, this seems a little ridiculous, all these blues. I'm probably better off with a bunch of reds, but you know what? Let's just send it right now, okay? And then, you know. I mean, that works. I don't know, how, I don't know why your AI is like this, but I don't like it. Okay. Yellows, we aren't going to make the same mistake we did last time. Though it does make me wonder if you can just throw them over. It's like, time is of the essence here, man. Also, why would you put the bomb rock thing on on top of a ledge like this? Why would you do that to me? Okay. Uh, whoa. Anything else? It looks like there's a bomb rock in there. If you ask me... Maybe there's a bomb rock Pikmin in there. No. <laughs> I mean, like, I feel like I threw them as far away from the wall as I could and they were still like, Whoa! No, they weren't like, whoa. But... Why not drop the bomb right next to the reds? Why not just do it, you hacks? All right. What? Only two bombs made it. <gasps> Ooh! Only two bombs made it last time. Only two bombs. How is that possible? How was that possible, Big Man? How is that, how is that possible? <laughs> also, I like how there are candy pop buds back at the base. I didn't notice that last time. Oh yeah, I need the reds to push the box. That's what I need. I was gonna say, why not just walk the reds across and then put all the blues back? So I'm supposed to do this with 20 Pikmin, right? And I have 20 reds there. What happens if I put these guys back in the onion with their bomb rocks? That's a scary thought. Actually, I guess it doesn't matter. These guys can stay here. I guess. Oh yeah, the box. That's the box, incidentally. Man, imagine if I walked off there. Alright! Now we use the Wii Resin, right? Wii Resin, come on! Wii Resin, cooperate! Go 
after. There we go. That's the sound the box makes. We resin, come on, man. Okay, so now we have all the Pikmin. All of the Pikmin. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> okay, then. Forgot about this part. Wow, look at the time save on this. Wow, look at the cooperation of the team. I don't, I do not trust you over there. 20 Pikmin. So the idea is you're supposed to fight him over here. Oh, come on. <laughs> yeah, because then your Pikmin are safe in here. and They're the bomb rocks, incidentally. Um, I mean, I, I, I could. Just don't, I don't trust these guys. I don't trust these guys to, like, not get in my squad, and then I failed the challenge because the Pikmin decided that they, uh, didn't want to work properly. Okay. Separate. Uh, honestly, I don't, I don't think I've ever seen anyone fight this thing without the bomb rocks. I've seen them sacrifice Pikmin to do it, but, like, that's about it. Whee! <laughs> okay, it doesn't actually hurt Olimar. How big is that tongue? Right in his mouth, honestly. What the hell, man? Bow! This works, surprisingly. It's really the camera controls that are problematic here. <laughs> Just throw seven at a time, dude. That works. My cheeks! This, uh, this final boss theme is so interesting, dude. Oh no, are you dead? You're good. Ah. Supposed to be the throw button. <laughs> Getting a little ballsy. Oh! No! That's what happens when you miss. I feel like we're biased towards the side of the arena here. Careful, guys! Sorry, I'm like focusing a lot here. <laughs> like, no commentary. Okay, here's the jump! How does it do that? <laughs> you didn't really get to see it because, uh, camera, but. Actually, why'd I do that? 
Oh no! I kind of like the other camera better. Which is weird, right? Wow, you were quick on the draw there. Oh. I love his eyes, dude. Phase two attack. Wow, I didn't know you could just bite it. What the heck? You guys got it. Ah, I shouldn't have whistled. Okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's annoying. <laughs> Goes back to the center, I guess. Let's not get greedy here, even though the day is ending. You gonna do it again? Oh my god, come on. I'm trying my hardest to save him. Yeah. No. Every bit of damage counts, man. Go, 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 go. Go, boys, go. dead Did I just throw one in his mouth? <laughs> Sorry it didn't seem like that, but whatever. You gonna jump again, you piece of shit? No? I was gonna say, those moves are surprisingly close, huh? Oh, fuck. Come on, guys. What is that call? Not now, not now. <laughs> Did we do it? All right, good, good, good. All right, let's get the fucking part back, baby. Let's get the fucking part back, baby. Oh God. I found the final part of my secret save. And this is full as ever, how glad I am that I've persisted in my search without losing hope. Now I can leave this planet without any regrets. Maybe I'll even stop and pick up some souvenirs for my wife and kids back on planet Hoko Tape. Which is what he ends up doing. Bye guys. We gotta get this damn thing back. Didn't Carl say he could carry more than 80? Maybe not. Okay, whatever. They might not make it. They might not make it. They're not gonna make it. Oh, that sucks.
Guys, beeline it! Come on! They're gonna make it! They're gonna make it! They're gonna make it! <laughs> Woo! All right. Uh, other than the reset, man, that sucks. But like, I could have done it. I could have done it if the yellow pigment weren't so stupid. I finally recovered every ship part. Now I can return home to Hokotate. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. oh, God. <laughs> Okay, so, first playthrough with, uh, conditions. Interesting. I, I don't know if I can focus while the credit scene is going on, though. You know what I mean? I don't think I can focus on what I need to say. But, uh... Ugh. <laughs> and then you know it, it's heartwarming because they all, they all. Oh, look at that! They all, they all kill a bulborb somehow. Throw themselves on it, and it's scared of them for some reason. Doesn't make any sense, but it's supposed to be a happy little ending. Man, Earth looks kind of like crap, huh? Oh my god, my ears. And then everyone's like, oh my god, they're pink big men, tiny big men, orange big men, green big men, black big men, what the heck is up, what's up with that? And then it's never explained. And I think, like, orange Pikmin are in a fan game, they're immune to explosions, and, uh, I think green Pikmin were put in another fan game, but I don't know. They're not canon. Okay, you can see this ship disappear there. And now Almar's light just sticks out of the cockpit in this pre-rendered cutscene. <laughs> uh. And then doesn't it do the Shadow the Hedgehog thing? I don't know. Final analysis. All right, let's see how bad it was. Surviving Pikmin, 250. <laughs> Meanwhile, people probably had like 250 red Pikmin, and that's it. Total Pikmin lost 781. <laughs> that's a lot, isn't it? Uh, <laughs> wow. Total Pikmin ever sprouted, 1,200. So, I mean, yeah, you could just do the math, right? Like, basically, uh, two-thirds of all the Pikmin I ever made died. Maybe a little more than that. It's crazy. It's crazy, but not really. And there are all the ship parts. Ah, beautiful. Beautiful. It, it's done. I thought that this was gonna take me an hour or two. I don't know why. Do the Shadow of the Hedgehog thing, please. Oh, it's the credits. Okay. There's a Wada. Uh, the Wii edition, even. But, uh, okay. So, Pikmin. I think I said it before. I think that Pikmin is a great game. I think that, uh, it, uh, it has a cool story. It has a cool concept. It has cool environments. The fact that it's very open yet still not entirely open is very cool you know you can do all stuff and this playthrough even taught me that you could do things uh without like blue pikmin and apparently yellow pikmin never figured that one out but like you know it's like it's very open-ended in the speed run it's probably crazier but uh conceptually a very cool game i think that uh of course the ai kind of sucks but it's kind of hard to say because I feel like the AI sucked a lot when I was doing challenges. Not all the time. Definitely not all the time. Going up bridges, going through 
walls, um, dropping bombs near a wall that uh, is very far away and you shouldn't have done that, why did you do that? And then return to me when I'm on a cliff across the water. This is so loud. Uh, hold on. Maybe that's better. But, uh, you know, I think that the game itself is still a good game, but I think that how bad the how bad the AI is is very understated. That's my general two sentence or maybe even one sentence review of Pikmin 1. Um, as for the extraordinary whimsical Pikmin playthrough itself, I think that the concept is very fun. You know, a Pikmin day every day, which you could have just done, but then Carl kind of went above and beyond and not only like gave you like, you know, kind of limited it so that you actually do it in 30 days, but also like gave you tasks to do and even wrote it as a guide for new players. That really is going above and beyond. And, you know, obviously, that's that's partially why I jumped on it. Because I'm like, uh, hey, I, could, I love doing daily challenges and things. It's like a community event. It's interesting. Oh my god, my ears. It's still so loud on my end. Oh yeah, this is the, this is the casserole. I love this song, by the way. Okay, 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 anyway. <laughs> um, I, gotta, I gotta keep going. So I think, d despite everything, though, like, it's kind of obvious that uh, th this was rough around the edges. You know? Obviously, not gonna hide it. Um, I think that, obviously, the... I know, I know Carl was like, come on, man, like, stop... He told, he told me, stop, uh, stop nitpicking the fucking writing, but I think that the writing could have at least used a few lookovers. Maybe that's just me. Um, me having trouble reading, that was me. That wasn't, that wasn't really the problem with the writing. I just can't read out loud for some reason. Um, I think that the challenges maybe needed some testing, not just the ones that didn't work, but just in general. I think that, uh... They needed maybe more cohesion. I think the idea is like, my recommendation would be to play through, I, I think all the challenges should be possible to do on one playthrough. And I think that you should uh, play, you know, play through doing all the challenges to gauge how possible or difficult it is, which obviously didn't happen. Carl apparently had a hard enough time by figuring out what to do for challenges on his own anyway. And I mean, if that's the case, then you can't, I feel like you can't really do this again. Um, you can't really do this again with, uh, no, what am I saying? You can't do this again anyway, because like all the ideas for challenges are kind of taken up. This is a beta thing incidentally. I don't know if you noticed because you can't fight it here, but, uh, yeah, I think, like, because, you know, the idea, I, I mean, it wasn't even established anywhere that the challenges were, like, you can do both of them, you can do one or the other, or whatever. It's just that you don't really have to do them. Um, so some of them were ors, and some of them were ands, and some of them were, well, most of them were, like, kind of, you aren't really sure what you're supposed to do. So I would uh, iron that one out. This song is giving me a mind flood right now. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I mean, I, just, I think it, like, in general, just kind of need more testing, and Carl probably doesn't have enough time for that, so, like, I can't really blame him, but I feel like, in a way, it kind of reflected poorly on me. Should I have done the challenges when this is my first time playing Pikmin 1? Uh, I don't know, but I think that, uh, this playthrough had a lot of really bad moments <laughs> that paint me in a really bad light. And there were times where I'm like, there was a time where I'm like, I should stop, but then I'm like, no, uh, no, I want to do it because it's Carl's, like, it's for Carl, and it is fun and interesting, even if I'm sucking, I kind of thought of it in a way where, like, I'm sucking, but I'm kind of like the, I'm, uh, at least my playthrough is, like, interesting. I don't know about anyone else's because I haven't watched them, and they're also probably interesting, but you know what I'm saying, right? So, yeah, there's that, and then I'm like, maybe I should, like, private all the videos so that people don't think I'm some kind of prude. But, uh, I don't know, I think, I think it highlights, 
the AI, but at the same time, you're not supposed to play with it. So I'm gonna do a normal Pikmin playthrough just to, just to see what it's like, you know? If it's really as bad as I say it is, and I'm pretty sure it is gonna be, but... Yeah, it's like, the challenges were obviously the roughest part around the edge edges here, but, uh... At the same time, they're kind of what made the playthrough, so... If, uh, some kind of thing could be made there, I think that, uh, like a... I don't... What am I saying? If some kind of, uh... Like, maybe, like, polish? I don't know. Like, it's... I don't want to sound accusatory. But, uh... That's... I, I think there's no other way to say it, maybe? But, uh... Once again, it was still interesting. It, like... Some days were fun, some days weren't, but I think overall, in hindsight, overall, it was interesting. It was an interesting playthrough, and I'm I'm glad I did it. And honestly, it kind of, uh, remember like at the beginning of 2020, when I said, I made an announcement video saying, I'm going to start doing recordings for Blind Games, and they all have, maybe have like a, a daily upload schedule, stuff like that, and then I never did that, and it's... Uh, the end of July in 2021, and I'm being mind flooded again. Well, this was like, hey, this is a kind of forced daily recording activity, and yeah, sure enough, it's not bad. It's just, honestly, um, this is probably the worst way you could do it, it because it's like, don't, don't take this the wrong way. I'm Let me explain it. It's probably the worst way you could do it because you have to turn on the Wii U. You have to go into Wii mode. You have to get the Wii remote and nunchuck. You have to make sure the Wii remote's all calibrated. I had to put the sensor bar up. You have to get the image. You have to put the image in Discord, which isn't as easy as dragging and dropping in still somehow. You have to make sure that's all ready. You have to sit far away from the desk and uh, do the reading, and then you start playing, right? It's like, that's a lot. But still, it wasn't that bad. It was, I just turned, I'm just like, you know what? Like I, I said earlier, a lot of these I just did uh, basically around when I woke up. I just wake up, uh, get have some cereal, then just turn on Pikmin. <laughs> and uh, play it. And it's like easy. So hopefully this maybe uh, helped, helped uh, solidate. Yep, that's a word. That kind of concept to me where it's just, it's easy to record a 30 minute video every day. It's like so easy. And maybe that'll reflect better on me. But, uh, yeah, so I think overall, uh, Pikmin 1, still a great game. Uh, worse AI than advertised by the populace. Uh, also, I feel like I made people think, like, people probably resent Pikmin 2 just because of me. Please don't resent Pikmin 2 because of my attitude. Please, it's such a good game. Please don't do that. Uh, and as far as the extraordinary whimsical Pikmin playthrough goes, uh, I think that it just needs, it just needs some more polish and that's it, you know? Like, it's, it's a rough first start, kind of like Pikmin 1 in a sense, but I think, like it's a rough first start, but it still works like Pikmin 1. How about that? That's, that's how you tie it all together, right? Uh, I feel like that, that emphasizes the rough part more than the it works part, but hopefully the Pikmin analogy made it not seem that way. Anyway, whatever. Hey, 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 Carl, thanks. <laughs> thanks for doing it anyway, because even if it, even if it was maybe unpolished, uh, it, uh, it probably still took a lot of time to do. And I'm excited to start watching everyone else's playthroughs now that it's over and I can do it. And then, uh, I don't know when I'll play through Pikmin, but I'll probably stream that. I'll probably just do a normal playthrough of Pikmin. And now that I actually know everything, because I literally just played it, and some maybe new techniques, who knows how it'll go? It'll be interesting. Also, challenge mode, huh? I didn't know Pikmin 1 had a challenge mode. Sorry, I'm just curious. How many Pikmin can you grow in a day? Oh, okay, it's not like Pikmin 2's challenge mode. Don't say it, which is more interesting. God, you said it! Okay, whatever. <laughs> but I think th those are my overall thoughts. My honest overall thoughts. Please don't hate me. Please, I know, I know I wasn't, I know I, I wasn't uh, as jolly and fun in the entirety of this playthrough as uh, I wanted to be, but uh, Carl, please don't hate me. Please, please, 
Everyone, please don't hate me. <laughs> because because of my attitude during this, please. That's, that's kind of my other takeaway. It sounds like I'm protecting myself, but... I don't know, man. I think half of it's justified, half of it's like, come on, man, you should have uh, at least handled it better instead of letting your emotions take over. But hey, uh... I think I'm out of things to say. So... That's the game, and... Yeah! Also, to that, to that one person, I, I didn't I didn't do this. This is made by Carl101. There's a, there was a person in the comments that was like, an extraordinary whimsical Pikmin point. Dude, that name's hilarious. <laughs> I thought I thought I responded to that, but I remembered I did. I, I didn't make this, okay? This is this is Carl101. He's been playing Pikmin since 2008. So, and you know, he's, he's playing through Pikmin 3 now. He's played, he's played through it on stream countless times. I didn't mean to press the B button. And, uh... So, like, of course he'll make something like this. And I think he said he wanted to try something with Pikmin 2. And I've been brainstorming this, and I think that it's, uh... That's very hard. This is, like, this game is short, and... It's like Luigi's Mansion. I, I didn't mention that, but this game is like Luigi's Mansion, where you could beat it in an afternoon. And that is to its benefit, to a very high degree. Uh... So, it works as a kind of daily project kind of challenge thing. Uh... I really don't know how you do that with Pikmin 2 because it's so long. Like, would you do a challenge per floor? Maybe. Like, that's a lot of work. I I don't know how that's going to work. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, and yeah. I, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I want to say more, but I think I'm done. So, I will actually end this now. I will bookend this.